this is the exact strategy that I used to scale my agency to $100,000 a month and only work 10 hours a week. You have to take yourself out of the business and actually run the company and not have the company run you. This is my this is a piece of advice for everyone that is doing 10 to 20k as an agency owner a month and you are stuck in the day to day. You're stuck with clients that are nagging at you. You're stuck with clients that are always wanting your attention, always wanting your responses, and you have this limiting belief that you always need to be available for people because you're going to lose your clients. If you're not available, if you don't respond right away, if you don't satisfy your clients, you're going to lose the clients. You always think that. And so the problem is I've been there and it's the worst feeling in the world where you're taking on sales calls, you're focusing on building the company and you can't scale that way because you're just like, your, your time is spread every single direction ever. And so guys, here's my one piece of advice and here's exactly what I did. So one thing I did was when I was at, I own a short form content agency. It's, uh, we do a hundred thousand dollars every single month, like I said, and I'm going to be providing a ton of value on how I got out of the day to day and, and how I'm, I'm looking to scale and exit at $5 million in the next 12 months. And so guys, the way I did it was I was communicating with my clients for, uh, through WhatsApp at first, my first 10, 20 clients. And they kept asking me the same exact questions. Everyone was asking me the same questions. And I found that there's like a common 10, 20 questions. And so I was getting burnt out scaling, uh, scaling everything that I was doing and answering all these questions all the freaking time. And so what I did was I went and hired a COO. Yeah, like, yeah, it might cost you a little bit, but it bought me back my time and sanity. And so what happened was I went and hired a, a virtual assistant on uh, onlinejobs.ph and literally just, I was like, hey, I want to start delegating this role to you. And so what I did was I went and created a, uh, I, a Slack. I went and got Slack and I created channels for each and every client invited them in there and the client was to communicate with the COO, the video editor and whoever else was in there and not me. And so out of nowhere, I just bought myself four or five hours a day that I was spending catering to every client's requests. And so what I did was I found out the top 20 questions that were always asked. I taught it to my COO. Here's how you respond. Here's how you fix this issue. Here's how you do this. And yeah, it's like you take one step back in order to go 10 steps forward. I promise you guys, when you step out of the day to day and you're, you're like, okay, cool. Like now I'm not doing this nitty gritty work. Now you can actually scale the agency. Now you can actually scale to 20, 30, 40, 50 K a month and make some real money because you're not doing the, the little VA work. And so my, my one piece of advice for you watching this video, if you're an agency owner, my one piece of advice is clients don't care who does it or who responds or who fulfills on the item or whatever it is that they, that they signed up for. They don't care who does it, whether it's you, a virtual assistant, some other assistant, someone else, somewhere else. It doesn't matter who does it as long as what they, what they paid you for gets done and it gets done right. And so that is all that matters. When, you, when, when that happens time after time after time again, you start realizing, man, I don't need to be in this day to day. I don't need to be doing all this stuff. And so here's how I do it. Now we have 120 clients and I'm not even talking to my clients. Majority of the time it's, I'm not talking to my clients one bit. I'm focused on scaling. We just hired more setters, have a closer. We're running ads, doing all these things, trying to scale to three, 400 K a month and really scale because I'm not bogged down by those small tasks. And so I'm going to leave you guys with one thing. Clients don't care who does the task as long as it gets done. Clients don't care that it's you responding as long as someone responds. Get that through your head because that is such a limiting belief that you need to take care of everything. You need to be there for everything. You need to be the guy that does everything all at once for your clients. That's not how it works. That's not how you scale to $100,000 a month plus. And so guys, I'm going to start providing value on how I build my agency how I delegated everything, how we acquire clients and how we do this all. See you on the next one, guys. Hit that subscribe button.